in this module we will discuss subclasses of mammals there are three subclasses of mammals prototheria metatheria and eutheria uh, prototheria are more reptilian uh, they have a cloacal opening instead of separate openings for digestive system and a urogenital system and uh, they lay eggs and their mammalian characters are that they have a thick fur and uh, there is a presence of mammary glands the examples of uh, prototheria are as shown duckbill platypus and uh, spiny ant eater this is spiny ant eater and this is duckbill the next subclass is uh, metatheria in metatheria there is an abdominal pouch present which is called as marsupian uh, where they bring bring up their uh, young and their young ones are most of the time present uh, within this pouch which is called as marsupian and uh, it is to be noted that uh, they have mammary glands inside their uh, uh, these uh, marsupium uh, the examples of uh, these marsupials or uh, metatherians are uh, kangaroos and then we have another class which is known as uh, eutheria and uh, this class uh, includes placental mammals in this uh, class eutheria the body of a mother develops the uh, young in uh, its maximum and it is uh, when it is born it is a uh, developed uh, many features so that is why they are known as uh, placental mammals and uh, they have a maximum uh, mammalian characters but in some the hair have become modified to scales for example uh, the pangolin and these hairs are modified into spines for example porcupine and the example of eutheria is that of a man whale elephant horse rat or mice 